feelings there, the Macedonian army. Uh, we see people coming up to the gate making desperate appeals. We've just seen a man going up with his child and asking them to open it, but uh, no sign they're going to do that anytime soon. And in fact, we've had word from the police on the opposite side that it will remain closed. But through here, if we just peek into the departure tent, as we might call it, here are the next 50 who are waiting to go through. And they've been waiting there since Monday morning. Pretty squalid inside, but they're not going to move in case they miss the very thin chance that the gate reopens. And just to show you the camp around here, you might be able to see that it's looking pretty dismal today. The rubbish is beginning to pile up, the rain is falling again, and yet there is this sort of semi-permanent feel to the camp. So people are digging trenches around their tents so the water doesn't get in. There are little businesses starting up. We've seen barbers today. We've seen Syrians selling on food and produce from the Greek side. And we've seen a few tears as well. But these people have endured so much so far and they're not going to leave this camp when there is just the slimmest chance they can get into Macedonia. The border is closed. We don't know what time we, it's opening. Uh, we are feel too tired. All people feel tired and what we don't know what we're doing now. We heard that uh, Merkel said uh, no, no border will, will be closed. So that's why we are waiting. If not, okay, tell us what we have to do. We have no other area to go, no other place. Lots of women and children and unaccompanied minors in this camp. Uh, one or two of them here hiding in this tent. Uh, as I say, it is raining and plenty of people on the road this morning. We walked the last mile, in fact, with some people for two hours today. And there are hundreds of people on the road, even though they know the abysmal conditions that are here in this camp. And even though the news is filtering down the refugee trail, as it tends to do, Mo word moves very fast here. But these people have no confidence in the resettlement program in Athens. And that is why they'll take any chance to come here.